It's a new age, and you have to accept it. My robots are here to stay. Detroit will become the first city policed entirely by my machines. No brains, no glitching, total control. So that's it? You just gonna replace us? You've already been replaced, honey. Can't you see it? What are you talking about? Murphy's one of us. You're a little confused. That's Robocop you're talking about. Murphy's the guy who's legally dead. That's it. We are going on strike. We are cops. Cops do not go on strike. That's the spirit, old timer. I have important people to meet, multi-million dollar contracts to sign. You know, the usual. Well, that sucks. We can't just sit here and do nothing. You can do something. Your cruiser needs cleaning after your last shift. If you have a hard time finding something to do, come to me. That goes for the rest of you, too. Murphy, briefing room, now. First of all, I don't want to hear a word about those damn robots. We have a job to do. Now that the milk is spilled, we are looking for a mole in OCP that's been protecting Antonowski. As hard as it is to believe, Becker is not that guy. Yeah, but he's still a prick. Sure is, but there's still a mole that we need to find. It's gotta be the rookie. I'm sitting right here. So? We start by asking the source. What are you suggesting? I pay Wendell a visit in jail. Good thinking. You can try to squeeze a confession out of him. If I get my hands on him, I will squeeze more than just a confession. Hey, Murphy. That news lady's in the lobby waiting to talk to you. Robo, do you have a minute? Listen, I wanted to say that I misjudged you. My crusade is against OCP. You were just collateral. So to extend an olive branch, I'd, I'd like to give you this. What is it? It's the tape of you glitching the other day at the mall. It's the only copy, so you can do whatever you want with it. I am sure your TV station would love to play the tape. Yeah, that's why you need to take it before I change my mind. Thank you. Now that I have you here, can I interview you as a consolation prize? They want me to ask you about the election. Seems that people value your opinion. I would be happy to oblige. Okay, roll the tape. I'm here at Metro West conducting an interview with a man that needs no introduction. Robocop, one of the more contentious points brought up during the election, is the construction of Delta City. Many believe that Delta City will destroy old Detroit. Mayor Kuzak spoke at length about the illegal evictions that OCP has been planning in order to start the construction. Other candidates, namely John Mills, believe that Delta City is a chance to clean up the city. What are your thoughts on this subject? Is Delta City the future of old Detroit? Delta City will be Detroit's downfall. So you agree with Mayor Kuzak that Delta City will bring more harm to the city? Thank you for clarifying your stance on this important topic. 
This has been Robocop for Channel 9. Samantha Ortez, signing off. Thanks for the interview, Robo. We'll get out of your hair as soon as we're done packing up the equipment. I saw Becker tear the rookie a new one for what he did at that factory. I was no surprised if he was already in the hey, sh oh, she is doing real good. She had that fire in her eyes. Still keep that metal fuck running. What a waste of electricity. I mean, he did catch you. you Robo, the prisoner's waiting in the visiting room. Oh, gonna have to strip search you. Belt, keys, loose change, huh? <laughs> I'm kidding. Just keep walking. I don't think that was funny. Good to meet you, Robocop. The visiting room is at the end of the corridor. Good to see you in my prison, Robo. Did the inmates at the entrance welcome you properly? I felt at home, almost. I'm glad you're here. I want to ask you about the man you're here to see. The only thing I know is that he's no ordinary prisoner. OCP are keeping his record secret. So who is he? He is a criminal awaiting his trial. But I need to know who I'm dealing with. He's a demanding individual. There used to be peace in my prison, but now they're rabid dogs. He turned all the gangs against each other. So either OCP doesn't know who they're dealing with, or there's something fishy going on. I suspect OCP knows more than they are telling. I'm here to verify that. Ah, uh, good. Come see me after your interview. I have a humble gift for you and your police friends for keeping my business alive. The best way to keep my hands busy is to hand me a criminal. Oh, so much anger. I know where it's coming from. Alex Murphy. 
You didn't expect to hear that name from me, did you? I used to think that erasing the memories of your past life would help you the way it helped me. Oh, but I was wrong. And I want to make it up to you by giving you that life back. A better life from a low-life criminal, I will pass. Even if it's a chance for you to play baseball with your son once again, the new OCP project is what will make this possible for you. Is that why you needed all those dead bodies? I could tell you more if you promise not to stick your nose in. I want details of the project and the names of those involved. Our time is up. But I wouldn't want to leave you empty-handed. So let me at least give you this. The project's called Afterlife. Tread carefully. It's the last chance for you and your family to be together again. We have to take the prisoner back to his cell. Looks like a full-blown riot is going down. Whatever is going on, this slime is involved. Could be, but now we have to focus on the other prisoners. They're armed and storming the warden's office. We need your help. Robo? I will turn them to the path of reform. Heavy weapons like fucking hot dogs at a football game.
shoot! I'm unarmed!
Robocop, I owe you. We have to stop these creeps from taking over the prison. You bet we do. Wendell has to be behind this. I need to find him. I knew he was up to something. His cell is in Block B. And Robocop? Give him my regards. I will give him much more than that. Call me on the radio if you need me. Sir, Block A is clean. Good. Let's keep it that way. I expected on my We need to seal off this area. If you go further, you won't be able to turn back. So, do you want to proceed? I am ready to proceed. Okay then, good luck. Glad you're here, RoboCop. I think I saw someone, someone from the outside. Those couldn't have been prisoners. They were armed to the teeth. Remember my promise? I've got a wife and kids, please. I promised you that one day I'd blow your head off. <laughs> Checking in. We're approaching the client. Affirmative. Robocop is still at the facility. There's no threat. I'm not fighting! Robocop. New arrivals. I saw them. They must be the ones who released the prisoners. The riots are a smokescreen. They're heading for his cell. I'm, I'm not an on enemy! My way there now. Wendell's cell is empty. Intruders beat me to it. Robo, I'm just getting a signal that the hostiles were spotted moving towards the property store. Wendell included. I will meet them there.
Don't disturb me! I have laundry to do! You are not safe here. No, I can't lose this job. It's the only thing that's keeping me sane. Besides, I've got orders. You are in emotional shock. You should report to the guards and get professional assistance. I've already lost one job because of you. I won't let you do it again. Get lost. Thank God you're here! Oh, I don't know how to thank you! Oh, Martha needs me, you know? Oh, it's such a great car! But they'd probably scrap it if I died here! You saved us both! Thank you.
the situation here? That guy's got a ticket for the mercy seat in a month, but he was shot, and it looks like justice will get him sooner. <laughs> That's no reason to leave me here to die! I can't take him with me, and I'm not gonna stay here. Justice can only be served by executing court orders. You're more human than this fucking jailer!
Last week I finished organizing the stuff down here with a brand new system. And today, those fuckers showed up and messed everything up. Where did they go? To the parking lot. You have to bust them. I'll be cleaning this shit up until retirement. The scum's over there, hiding behind his bodyguards. I need to smoke him out. Can't you get it through that thick skeleton? You're supposed to stay away from my business if you want to get your past life back. How about we save part of that life right now? I sent some guns to the hospital to rectify my mistake and finish the job with your friend Lewis. But it was before we talked. I would have called off the hit, but I had to take care of you and your fellow guards. So, I guess it's over to you. And you better hurry. Casualties at Gibson Memorial Hospital. I need assistance. Possible hostiles in the vicinity.
I'm all right, Murphy. I'm all right. Oh, thank God you're safe. We've missed you, officer. How are you feeling? A little banged up, but I've certainly been worse. That Wendell guy needs to pay for what he did. And he will. But when? How many more innocent people have to get shot before that happens? OCP doesn't have our back. We know that Wendell's working for him. You know what we should do? Don't even say it! We should go on strike. Yeah! Sergeant, how can we go out on the streets knowing that the people who hire us are working against us? Don't forget about the robots. We will discuss this further, but first, Murphy, it's time for your evaluation. I'll be catching up on what's been going on, partner. Oh my god, Lewis is back. Hey, Steph, how's my hair? Looks like an elephant took a dump on an ostrich egg. So, you also noticed the symmetry of my face? Whatever, shithead. <laughs> <laughs> 